My brothers and sisters in Islam, why is the first month of the Islamic year a month of fasting? The first month is a month of fasting because the one who begins with a powerful start, his ending will also be powerful. At the Shuf, Islam began powerful as well. Islam began with the month of Ramadan. Islam began when the Quran came down during Ramadan. Powerful start to Al Islam. Allah Azza wa Jal gives us another chance and He gives us a month. And if you start this month correct, and you make the most of it from the very beginning, the one who has an incredible, absolute, awesome, perfect start, bi'ithnillahi ta'ala, Allah Azza wa Jal blesses the rest of the year for him, and he'll find the power to continue in his relationship with Allah Azza wa Jal during that year. My brothers and sisters in Islam, when you begin this year with this noble deed of fasting, the worship that keeps you away from all pleasures, and the worship that keeps you away from all temptations, enjoyments of life, you begin with a powerful start. And in the same hadith that Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, that same hadith in where he said that the best fasting after Ramadan is shahrullah al-muharram, in the same hadith he said, وَأَفْضَلُ الصَّلَاةِ بَعْدَ الْمَكْتُوبَةِ الصَّلَاةُ فِي جَوْفِ اللَّيْلِ And the best prayer after the obligatory prayer is the prayer in the middle of the night, more specifically in the last third of the night. Why did the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam why did he put these two things in the hadith? He said to us in the same hadith that the best fasting after Ramadan is fasting Muharram. And in the same hadith, he said that the best prayer after the obligatory prayer is the last third of the night. As though this is an indication from Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam to start the year with fasting and with salatul layl, the last third of the night. What a fabulous start to the year. The one who begins the year like this, with fasting the days and praying the nights, bi'ithnillahi ta'ala, Allah Azza wa blesses the rest of the year for him. Yani as though the hadith is giving us the prescription for a blessed year. The prescription, that prescription that you take from the, from, the, from the pharmacist, from the doctor. The prescription for a blessed year is from the beginning of the year. You fast its days as much as you can, and you pray the nights as much as you can. Bi'ithnillahi ta'ala, you find this kind of blessed year before you.